is my friend Phil, and we're celebrating our birthdays together. Yay! Phil is 40 years old in recovery. <laughs> Happy birthday, Solstice. Uh, thank this you. is your belly button birthday. <laughs> and my AA birthday or sobriety birthday happens to be the same day, October 1st. What better place to be than Lava Hot Springs? <laughs> <laughs> Where we get to play a lot. Is I love my life. That is the place I am living in today, in this moment. My name is Solstice Elliot. I'm 46 years old, and this is my vlog where I share with you my adventures of how I stay youthful inside and out through conscious living and personal transformation. Thanks for watching Soul Tribes. Subscribe and be part of my tribe. My friend Grace said I could camp on her land if I was ever in Lava Hot Springs. So I call this place Graceland. I unexpectedly met Phil, who is caretaking this land, and found out we have the same birthdays. And so we decided to celebrate together by soaking in hot springs, doing some watsu, and also a massage trade. It's my birthday week. I like to celebrate all week long. I'm starting out doing the process with my friend Phil, who is offering me to work through the Byron Katie process. And this is how I like to spend my birthday, releasing crap. I know that sounds weird. I find that birthdays actually subconsciously get you to reflect back on your life and wonder like, is this really, really where I want my life to be going? They do kind of bring up a lot of stuff. So I actually just plan to do some nice healing work around birthdays. And that's kind of how I celebrate. I do stuff fun too, but <laughs> let's just face it. Birthdays make you have to reflect on stuff if you're really self-aware. Phil and I started out with a fire breath meditation this morning and he did a diksha healing on me so that was really awesome way to start the day just wanted to show you real quick my new necklace that my friend lauren she did this wrap for me i gave her this laramar stone which comes only from the dominican republic and it represents the ocean and water to me this stone was given to me by my friend justin and there are 11 branches in this tree, which is like my favorite number 11. So I'm just super excited. She just intuited all of that. And this is, looks like the tree of life. But it also looks like kundalini rising, like the double helix, like because it's on both sides. And I am just thrilled with the result. If you ever need somebody to do an awesome wrap for you, I'll put Lauren's contact information in the description below. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> oh man. Uh, it still feels so good though. I like it just, <sighs> just the way it is. <laughs> this is 
the one, two, pull. Hey, I'd like to keep inspiring people to feel like a kid again. <laughs> I really want to keep creating these videos to inspire people to follow their fun. So if every one of my subscribers donated just $1 per month, that would be more than enough money for me to keep creating these videos. Thank you so much for your support, Soul Tribe. Watsu is a form of aquatic bodywork. Through a series of stretches and moves, you feel nurtured as you float in 98 degree water, which mimics the amniotic fluid temperature when you were in the womb as a baby. A perfect day so far. Phil and I are gonna finish up this perfect day by doing the Byron KD process with me and I'm gonna do a QHHT session on him and then we're gonna soak again. <laughs> <laughs> Tell us more Phil what you feel like is the secret to your success of being 40 years recovered. So for me sobriety is about waking up. It's really stopping the ancestral passing on of dysfunction. And I get to be the one to actually say the buck stops here. And it actually has. So I'm so, so super grateful for everything that has been shown me and for the opportunities I've had to not follow this path of drugs and alcohol, which is a pandemic, I believe, on the planet right now. <laughs> and that there's an answer and a solution to whatever problem that we may have, whatever it is. What I do in my recovery today is stay connected to my inner child, that's who I am, that's what I'm about, and that's the part of me that's spontaneous and likes to play and likes to have fun. My new mantra is a soak a day keeps the stress away, so I've got my, my life coaching shirt on right now, because I love my life. And that is the place I am living in today, in this moment. So thanks for allowing me to share that solstice and for being here for a few days to celebrate together. Yeah, it's been a blast. <laughs> <laughs> and it's cold as hell out here this morning. Yes. <laughs>
Like feel, I feel like the secret to feeling like a kid again is to heal your wounded inner child. He feels like that's the secret to him maintaining 40 years of sobriety is the healing of his wounded inner child. Isn't it? <laughs> what an epic birthday. I just love fall. It just feels like all of the colors of the leaves are like confetti, like a parade celebrating life. The thymus is our gland of spiritual awakening. Have you noticed yours fluttering? It tends to flutter like butterfly wings when our heart chakra is expanding, sending energy upwards to awaken the high heart chakra. One of the most important keys to success is having the discipline to do what you know you should do even when you don't feel like doing it. Phil was talking to me about how he helps his coaching clients meet their goals and their dreams. I don't really do that. I just put things down on a to-do list and look at it and see what feels like following my fun for that day or that moment. I'm wondering if I need to be more disciplined. What do you think? Put it down in the comments below. Happy flowers for my birthday, along with the mint that I stole. Check out this really cool bag that I got from my friend Jessica for my birthday. She made it, and it's got just beautiful fall colors. I'm going to use it, I think, to put water bottles in and carry it. Fun.
This is Phil's garden that he grew on Graceland. He had to head out to a cob building workshop, but he said I could help myself to some beets. Beauties. I'm super excited to grate these into a salad. He says I can have a pumpkin too, so I can carve it for Halloween. I don't know, look at there's this little baby one here. And like there's a little baby cantaloupe, I can have that too, he said. I kind of think. I don't know, the little baby one is very cute. Oh my gosh, that one's so adorable. That one's even smaller than the one I was thinking of taking. I kind of think I want the little baby for a little minivan. There we go. I'm heading south now for a birthday party with my siblings who live in the area as well as my cousin and his family. Instead of New Year's resolutions, it's like birthday resolutions, and I'm still thinking about, do I need to be more disciplined? Instead of just following Hello. my phone. Hi. Hi. I documented, apparently, <laughs> everything. Everyone told me. <laughs> Thanks. Uh, happy birthday. Hi. I like your rock <laughs> and blending that in. <laughs> That's your Thank you. Hey. Hey, how's it going? How's it going? Hi, Thank you. Happy birthday. <laughs> I'm here. Hi. I'm Katrina. Hi, Katrina. It's so nice to meet you. Hey, Anna. Hi, Solstice. Happy birthday. Thank you. I love war games, but the technology has evolved so far that it's going to be a little older. My inner child watched one of my cousin's grandbabies celebrate his first birthday party with a smash cake. And I never got a first birthday party with a smash cake. It wasn't really done in my era, so I really wanted to do that, and now I'm doing it. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear solstice. Happy birthday to you. Do you know the details of your birth? Okay. Any of them. This is the family tradition. This is the family tradition, at least in our family. I am third in 11 children. The, the thing that's the most significant is when I came home from the hospital, my mom said I laughed like an adult. And she was so scared that she would keep checking my crib in the middle of the night, worried that I would just like go back to heaven because she felt like I was just so connected to heaven and the spirit world that because I laughed like an adult and I wasn't really like a baby crying, laughing. Yeah. All right, this one's from Tiara and Liam, no? Yeah, okay, thank you. Oh, thank you. Oh, thank you so much. I love Target, it's one of my favorite stores. And this one is from Sterling. So the card says, this birthday cake tastes like boogers. Well, it is <laughs> carrot cake. <laughs> Oh cool, Chick-fil-A. Were you the one that was telling me? I, no, it's my my niece. I've never been to Chick-fil-A. Like Mallory, she's like, you gotta go, we gotta go to Chick-fil-A. <gasps> oh yeah. I love this. These are awesome. Thank you. Oh cool, thank you. 
Yeah, I love snacks for the for the band. <laughs> Happy birthday, so I hope it's a good one. That's all I can add. Ranger and Mara from the Burlington Burlington Coat Factory. Oh nice. Cool. Wow, thank you. We figured winter's coming, so you Yeah, know, yeah. Winter clothes. Thank you so much. <laughs> wow, you guys. Thank you. Thank you. Happy birthday.